Hello everyone, this is Scabcat242, and this is the third week of October 2023, and we have another great yard sale video game haul to share. So, I was not anticipating this. Um, it wasn't as great as last week, could be, but I have a little story to go with this. So, I got all, well, most of all this came from a parking lot sale that took place at a Elks Lodge. So, the main reason why I went to this sale, I want to say last week, someone had posted an ad that they were selling their ex-husband's game collection. And from the photos, it was GameCube, N64, Wii, DS. And I did try to contact this person, but they never got back to me. But they were going to be supposedly selling at this parking lot sale. So I got there super early and by super early i mean like 6 a.m and to get a general idea the sale is not start till 8 so i'm there at 6 a.m on the dot there's like really nobody there so after sitting in my car texting i waited maybe 20 minutes and then just kind of browsed around again it was still dark so i had my flashlight so didn't really see anything right away, but I did ask people as they were halfway done setting up. So this is the first thing we picked up. So we got here some Wii, Wii U games. Um, some lady had these in a box. She didn't have too many games, but the prices were pretty fair. I got all these for uh, 13 bucks. So we got Legend of Zelda, Skyward Sword, Donkey Kong Country Returns, and Yoshi's Woolly World. Then they were in good condition. Um, these were probably the only best games that they had in that box so I was happy to get those and as I was still waiting for that supposed seller to show up this I'm surprised um I almost missed someone not only had a Xbox 360 in the box and from what they said they said it was barely used um I actually opened it and the um plastic wrap still on there but not but when they told me there was more it came with all these games and yeah 20 bucks they only wanted 20 bucks i was shocked but probably the nice find in there was killer is dead the special edition they wanted to play this game so definitely looking forward to adding that to the collection but yeah quite a bit of games here i'm not going to go over all of them but like you got your typical xbox 360 mandatory lists like Assassin's Creed and of course your Kinect stuff. Oh, by the way, there was Kinect as well. Um, your Star Wars Force Unleashed, Injustice, Forza Motorsport, Halo. Yeah, it's a mixed bag of stuff. There's some pretty decent titles in there and some, some filler, but good filler. But yes, good amount of games. And then in this bag, some other accessories, I think. There was some, another controller. Yeah, so there's the controller, and then there is like this little control with the keypad. So yeah, excellent find. I think if I didn't find the Wii games, I would have been happy with this. So after sticking around for maybe three hours, it was obviously this person was not going to show up, and then it occurred to me, I think that ad was fake. So unfortunately, that's the case if it was, but I'm not too upset because... What I walked out with was great, but the one thing I don't understand, during the whole time I was waiting, I was walking around back and forth, looking through people's um, stuff. There were a number of other game collectors who were waiting. They were just standing there on their phones. And I'm just thinking, why are you guys waiting just doing that? There's stuff to be found, but whatever. I'm happy to find this. Um, there was someone I'm going to mention, but I decided not to because I kind of see this person on a daily basis. But I'm just going to say they're a person who has a shop at the Folsom Boulevard Flea Market who I'm not too fond of. So I'm not going to say his name, but I was, it was just great to see him not find anything. But other than that, so as I left the sale, there was a couple of other small yard sales I wanted to go check out. Uh, one, I missed out. Well, it was like past 9 o'clock, so... That's not a surprise, so I didn't find any games there. But I went to another sale along the way. Some guy had a he had a PS2 lot and a PS4 lot. Um 
The PS2 lot was pretty okay. I almost thought about buying the whole thing, but there was too many sports games. And the PS4 came with some pretty good games, but since I just bought one for a better price, I passed. But this is what I picked up for $10 bucks, uh, from the PS2 game. So we got uh, Godzilla Save the Earth. WWE Smackdown Shut Your Mouth Peter Jackson's King Kong Smackdown vs. Raw 07 and not one but two copies of Smackdown Here Comes the Pain regular and greatest hits edition so all that for 10 bucks so yeah another great weekend I'm very pleased with what I found so yeah tell me what you think was the best find in this lot so again thanks for watching and hopefully we'll have another great successful yard sale weekend until then, see you later.